What's up, y'all? Welcome back to the channel. Got some new content today. Uh, we'll be reviewing a Mustang 5.0. So this is the first for the channel. A nice little Mustang. It ain't little, but it's it's it's, it's really nice. Um, the dude's super cool. Like I just hit him up in his DMs. I seen him at one of the car meets, and uh, he just hit me back. Like, yeah, man, I'm more than welcome. I mean, you know, more than happy to go ahead and do the review. So we set up the date. Now we got it going. Um, Got my little one here. Say hello. Yeah. Wow, she actually said hello. Yeah, so we're about to get this going. Let's get to it. Break on that beat, going crazy. Man, that's badass. Not again. It's a All right, y'all, like I said, we're here with uh, Brandon. He got his nice 5.0, this is a 2017. Uh, this is pretty dope, it's a half and half wrap. Uh, he just got some new wheels put on there too, so we'll do a walk around the car. You'll hear him talking in the background and uh, let's get to the review. So introduce yourself and then we'll get to the car. I'm Brandon or Snow 5.0, uh, this is my Mustang here. Yeah, see, I don't fucking talk about it. <laughs> That's all good. Let's uh, let's start in the front, and then we'll work our way around. Okay. So, can we just like say what's done? Or... Yeah, just kind of give us a walk, just a walk through of the, what conversions you got done as far as your hood, your uh, front end. Okay. Um, 
So yeah, on the front end, we got the GT500 bumper. Um, I recently got that uh, about two months ago because I got in a small collision um, with my old bumper. So I just said, uh, just get the upgraded one. That's dope. Um, not the not the accident part, but at least you was able oh, to upgrade yeah, yeah, it. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. And then I got the Cervini 4-inch cow hood. Um, I had the stock hood. I, I actually like the stock hood. I have those little vents, carbon fiber and everything. Um, but then um, I was looking at it, I was like, on a bag of car, it needs a bigger hood. So Yeah. Like, and that's a more aggressive look. Oh, it's, 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 I think it ties well in with the bumpers. So. Most definitely. Um, and then... Headlights, are they aftermarket? Well, so it's tinted right now, but I got some demon eyes in there and stuff, so it changes colors. The tri-bar, they don't change colors yet. Okay. Um, I'm actually going to be sending my headlights pretty soon to a company in Florida, and they're going to tear apart the whole headlight, and it's going to be all that orange little uh, side marker is going to be black and all that stuff. So. Okay, cool. Yeah. Cool. Um, so front wheel setup, what are you running on the front? So the front... Uh, it's actually a squared setup, so the wheels are squared, so it's 10, 15 by 19 with a positive 15 offset. Okay. Um, the tires in the front are 265, uh, 30, R19, and then the rear is 265, 35, R19. Damn. Um, so not a lot of traction. Yeah. <laughs> so more show. More show for sure, yeah. Yeah, more show. And uh, the tires I'm running right now, they're just super cheap tires. I was uh, actually just buying them just to test fit the fitment and everything, just to see the correct sizes and all that stuff. Okay. Um, but I'm probably about to put it on some Michelins or Nittos here in a second, so this gives you a little bit more traction. Oh, for sure, yeah. You mind talking about the uh, Cali Creamin you got here? In Cali the Creamin. Uh, it's the homies from Cali. You know, they have a brand out there. Um, definitely go check them out. They got lots of cool merch. They do giveaways, um, tons of different stuff. They got, like, air fresheners, literally everything you can think of. Okay. Um, it's just a... It's not a club, it's, it's a brand, but uh, definitely a bunch of dope people. They do rallies and stuff, they host meets. Um, some awesome people and some crazy builds too. I don't I don't know which side of the car I like better, the white or the black. <laughs> because I was always into black cars, but then I got that white one. But I don't know, I like... I think I think it like, I mean, I bought, so the car is originally white, right? So okay. I like, I've always wanted a white car. I, I love white cars. My two previous cars were gray, so I was like, switch it up um but then i had a friend that had a murdered 5-0 just oh, blacked shit. out and i was like damn that looks really nice <laughs> so this idea kind of came to me um uh i don't know you know juice world yeah you know the song black and white yes sir so he has in the music video he has a benz that's wrapped like this oh i didn't even realize that so i was like oh shit that'd be dope for my mustang so I kind of did that, and then I realized like this is already like a thing, but people kind of do it different. They usually do like satin, or they yeah. do some sort of like. Yeah. I was like, no, I'm just gonna go gloss and do like directly down the middle, um, and then kind of make it look like two different cars on both sides. Like my badges on that side are blacked out, um, all that stuff. But I think the white looks good in contrast to the black. I think if it was just all white, I think it's kind of boring. <laughs> it is a dope look. I mean, it's it's crazy. But I mean. So, under the hood, what do you have done? Uh, it's full bolt-on. So, you know, intake manifold, cold air intake, auto body injectors, tune, etc. All right. And for your uh, exhaust, what exhaust are you running? Um, so, it's running American Racing long tube headers. Okay. To, uh, it's Catalyst to uh, Porsche Extreme on the double X pipe. Okay. Um, so, it's pretty... Now, are those the extremes with those active uh, valves or no? no? Okay, okay. So you just loud all the time. Yeah. <laughs> I'm, just, I'm just asking. <laughs> There's no fight on this thing. Okay, okay. Just wondering because I know now they, of course, they do offer offer the uh, active dampening valves and stuff like that. So it's expensive though. Hell yeah. But here's the Instagram. Um, someone stole my beat. Oh shit! I didn't even realize that. <laughs> Let's, I'll, I'll go to the other side. I'm pretty sure it's here. Yeah. Okay, cool. Here's the Instagram. Somebody was uh, nice enough to take the other, be on the other side. Yeah, they thought they were funny. Yeah. And here goes the, the Corsa. Now, the diffuser, is it chassis mounted or how's the diffuser? Uh, no, it's literally just uh, some rivets into the, the valence down there. Okay, okay. Um, Street Arrow, they hooked me up with the, you know, 
It's a dope ass company. I don't know if you know about Street Arrow. No, I never heard of Street uh, Arrow. They make diffusers, splitters, side skirts, steering wheels, a bunch of different stuff. Okay. They're super cool. And it's good quality stuff too for like what the price you pay, you know? Yeah. Um, I like it. Um, it's just like a small little touch. They actually have like fins and stuff that go right here. Oh, okay. But, uh, I didn't like it was a little too much for me. Like I'm really into like the clean kind of look. Stealth look, yeah. Um, I'm waiting for a, I'm gonna get a carbon fiber, a little duct tail in the back right there. Okay. I don't want anything too crazy back there because I, again, like I just really like the clean, smooth look. So. I don't know if you ever seen the uh, 5.0. It's orange with the chassis mounted, uh, the big, big wing. Oh, uh, Alpha. Yeah, I think yeah, that's yeah. the name. Oh, yeah. Oh, that's dope. Yeah. Yeah, that one is crazy. That big old thing. He's also got the the bumper, like the police bumper. Yeah, in the front. yeah. That thing's crazy. Yeah, I've seen him at a couple meets. Um, man, that car is just, it's just crazy. Yeah, it's wide body. Yeah. yeah. So yeah, actually, I'll get there. I know. Same here. I mean, wide body. That seems like the new thing right now. Wide body. So, believe me, I think it's trending in the right direction. I, I've made. I've already seen two companies that I'm looking at for wide body kits. One of them just dropped a newer one. It looks slightly different from. Uh, I can't even think of the other company's name, but it's just a little bit more aggressive, which is probably something that I'll go with. Just to look different, because I see a couple of people running that that one company I'm thinking of, and I'm not, just, I'm not talking about fender flares like the wide body charge. I'm talking about the actual like wide, actual body. wide body. Yeah, yeah. not like just into the doors. Yes, yeah. yeah, where you got to actually do some cutting and stuff like that, yeah. and where there's no going back. I know a lot of guys, you know, no no disrespect to nobody, but I know some people just go and they, you know, they get fenders and stuff like that. But for me, if I go wide body, I'm going wide body. So that's that's just me. So man, I appreciate you, man. This is a quick video. Um, he actually has a, his uh, air ride suspension set up in the trunk. He actually did it himself. A lot of the stuff he did himself, um, as far as his um, his headers, his exhaust. Um, he did his air suspension himself. The front end, he didn't paint it. He went through Mod FX. Shout out to Mod FX. They uh, helped him paint the front end. So. This is, you know, this man is working on his own car. A lot of people can't say that, but you know, it's built by him. So, hey, this is this is a pretty dope ride. I love the the two the, the two colors. It's just it's crazy. I mean, like I said, appreciate you, Brandon. Of course, man. That'll be the end of the video. Let's see if we can get the comment section going. How do y'all like this car? I mean, it's, it's, it's dope as hell. It looked better in person, I'll tell you that. The camera don't do it too much justice, but this is a dope ride. And like I said, the man built, him, built it himself, so you gotta give credit where credit is due. So let's get the comment section going, see how y'all like this ride, two tones. Some people may, some people may not, but like always, respect the build because you know this is his car and he does what he wanna do with his ride, so. That'll be it. Peace.